In this video, I'll be comparing Lovable versus Bolt versus Cursor and telling you which of these AI powered coding tools may be best for you and your needs. So I'll break down their key features and go over what really sets them apart, and based on that, you can select which one may be best for you. So, first, let's go over Lovable. So, Lovable is best for non technical builders, early stage founders, entrepreneurs, and product teams who prioritize speed and simplicity. It is designed for rapidly converting text-based ideas into fully functional web applications without extensive coding knowledge. You can see a few examples from the community right here. And its approach is that Lovable takes a more conversational and collaborative approach. You describe your ideas in plain English and then the tool generates the app. It aims to reimagine the development workflow more as a dialogue. So its key features are natural language conversations that allow you to generate and modify code by just describing your ideas in English. Then you can do AI powered development, which means the AI handles the coding, iterating on changes and remembering project context. There's no setup required. It allows for visual editing, real time collaboration. There's a chat mode agent, so a dedicated assistant for planning, answering questions and diagnostics without directly modifying code. It has a GitHub integration, you can do custom domain publishing, and it has back-end support. So overall, Lovable's strengths are that it is excellent for quick prototyping, building MVPs, and straightforward applications. It focuses on user experience and abstracting away coding complexity. Now, its limitations are that you may struggle with complex UI customizations or very intricate server logic. Some user reviews also indicate potential issues with token consumption on larger projects and occasional debugging loops. Now, next we have got Bolt, which is also an AI coding tool. And overall, it's best for rapid prototyping, back end heavy teams, DevOps automation, and complex refactorings. It's a tool for developers who want to quickly create, edit, and deploy web and mobile apps in a browser. So that's an important distinction. Bolt is for web and mobile apps, whereas Lovable is just for web apps. Now Bolt's approach is that it is an AI powered coding tool that runs on Stack Blitz's web containers, allowing full stack application development without local software installation. It aims to act as a deeply integrated pair programmer. Now its key features are an in-browser IDE with complete development environment, so code editor, terminal, file system, and deployment options, and it's accessible directly in your browser requiring a zero setup. Then of course it has AI powered coding, also contextual understanding, infrastructure aware so it can write Docker files, GitHub actions, and Terraform scripts. Then it also has deep IDE integration, so both AI as an IDE extension, VS Code and JetBrains, focuses on contextual code generation, doc string writing, test creation and refactoring. So these strengths for both are that it is extremely fast for getting started and prototyping, and it's excellent for quickly setting up the original framework or adding major features. Now the limitations on both are that user reviews indicate significant limitations for production ready applications, especially with complex projects needing extensive databases, server logic or live updates. The token based pricing model can lead to pretty high costs for debugging. It may create duplicate components or lose consistency as your projects grow. Now, by the way, the pricing for Lovable, they have a free plan for public projects. If you want to have it private and get 100 credits per month for custom domains or remove the Lovable badge, it will be $25 per month and for teams, it's $30 per month. Now, finally, we have Cursor, which is best for pro developers who want to enhance their existing coding workflow with AI. It's an AI powered integrated development environment that integrates advanced AI features directly into the coding development. So its approach is that Cursor is a fork of Visual Studio Code, meaning it maintains a familiar interface for many developers while adding powerful AI capabilities, and it focuses on seamlessly embedding AI into your local code base and development workflow. So its key features are AI code completion, so it predicts and completes entire functions or blocks of code based on context. 
It also has chat features, intelligent code refinement, so it rewrites your code, inline code generation, Copilot++, so an advanced version of code suggestions that predicts multi-line code and helps navigate more complex patterns. Then it has an agent mode which can handle end-to-end -end tasks while keeping the developer in control. It has custom context retrieval, a Git integration, documentation and refactoring assistance so it generates inline comments, doc strings and helps with refactoring. And in terms of compatibility, it supports a wide range of languages, including JavaScript, Python, TypeScript, Java, C++, Go, and more. And it is available on macOS, Windows, and Linux. So the strengths for a cursor include the deep integration with the developer workflow, powerful AI capabilities for code generation, completion, refactoring, and debugging, and its context-aware suggestions are also very helpful. Now the limitations for cursor are the interface can feel a bit cluttered with all the AI specific buttons and chat tabs and the AI suggestions can sometimes be inconsistent. The agent mode can be challenging if instructions aren't precise and some users report keyboard shortcut conflicts with existing VS code habits. So in summary, Lovable is ideal for non-coders and rapid prototyping of full stack web apps with a conversational chat first approach. Both is great for quick in browser prototyping of full stack apps, especially if you want to bypass local environment setup. However, it may have limitations for complex production grade applications. And finally, Cursor is best for professional developers who want to supercharge their existing IDE with powerful, deeply integrated AI features for writing, refining, and understanding code. So that concludes this comparison of Lovable versus Bolt versus Cursor. If this video helped you make a decision, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.